Getting a degree abroad is not just a good experience in terms of having a good education, but it's actually more important than that, a great life experience. My name is Öykü Işık. I'm from Istanbul, Turkey, and I'm a PhD candidate at the Information Systems Department at the College of Business. My name is Sampat. I'm from India. Um, I came here to do my master's in uh, computer engineering department, specializing in VLSI, chip designing. I am John Zavala from Paraguay. I'm a marketing major. Technically, I'm just uh, I'm a junior, but this is my second semester here at UNT. Uh, my first two years, uh, I went to a college in San Antonio, Texas. My name is Faiz Khan. I'm from Pakistan, and uh, I'm a biochemistry major. I was asking friends, I was, ask, I was checking online, because I wanted to find a school that provided good education. Uh, my mom encouraged me to come here, yeah. She's very positive for going abroad. Fashion merchandising major in UNT is very famous, so I chose yeah, to study. It's big. <laughs> Came from a school of 400 to a school of like 35,000. I don't know how many thousand, but it's huge. So my name's Amy Jube, and I'm from South Africa. And I'm studying kinesiology, and I'm minoring in business. I actually came to UNT because of um, the vision that our coach had about the school. He was new to the program, we just had a new tennis facility that was built, so a whole new start for the program and it was just, I wanted to be a part of something like that. I did have a professor that went to school here for a while and another one who went to Miami but knew about UNT, so I kind of talked to him about like just how studying music was in here. I've always liked jazz, but I mean jazz is an American thing. So I always wanted to come here to America to study jazz. I actually prefer living in a small town because it helps you focus more. You see people more often, you get to know them better. You know, you kind of feel your place in the community. Denton to me is like how I live back home and then you have the big city like Dallas just down the road. So you're not in the rush of everything, but you're close enough to do stuff. Let's say 10 years from now or something, I'm not sure whether I'm going to be in India, China, Japan or United States. But hometown in United States is Denton and my favorite uh, team is Cowboys. <laughs> well, I'm taking molecular biology and biochemistry. And it's a really tough class, but the teacher we have, like the teachers we have here, they're of the top quality. I was working on uh, my master's, doing the course related to web designing, and I was actually a web designer here, so I could apply everything here and see a wonderful results. And then I could go back and talk to my professors. You know, there was a good communication going on, and that's the best best experience I had. They're trying to keep up with my progress and that really shows that they really care about me not just as a product of the PhD program but on a personal level. Thank you for your time. Sure. Good luck. And they have a beautiful rec center for people that like to work out. Maybe sometimes I play some basketball and sometimes I uh, lift weights. Depends on how I feel. As an international student, when you leave your home, there's this great cultural shock. So I wanted to come to some place where that was minimized. And uh, again, my friends, some of my friends were coming here and they told me that the international community is really huge here. They have great programs here, they have events here. So they said, you know, you once you come here, you feel right at home. Of course, as an international student, there are a lot of restrictions and some people really come here unaware of all those restrictions. So it's very important for them to stay in touch with International Advising Office and be aware of all those important you know, tricks and tips about studying here. I'd recommend UNT for anyone.